because they became um, his body. And his body was the representation, if you like, on earth of how it is that God might want us to be as human beings. So when we come to this moment, it's rich in history. But the point of it is not history. The point of it is present and future living. There's a lot of baggage around bread and wine. It's amazing how many fights have been had over the centuries over what is done with this. Who can have it? When they can have it? Who can do the magic hands so that people are allowed to have it? Um, how do you get the magic hands? Um, <laughs> and, um, and, and, and blood, still. Because somebody said, no, 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 you can't do that. So, there's a lot weighted in how we take this every week. So for me, um, and, and for us, I think, as, as we've kind of journeyed over, over the last few years, the, the simple core of this is an invitation to make something come alive. The point of gathering here and the point of ending with, with eating a piece of bread and drinking some wine is that we go and we live differently in the world, vulnerably, lightly, riskily, uh, in, in the name of love. So I'm not going to say uh, much else. Um, I personally think that anybody who is hungry for a different way of living, um, anybody who wants to leave some baggage behind, um, anybody whose life feels like it needs to take a different course, um, is welcome to eat this and you just need to eat it knowing that what it represents is not a snack before lunch, but a reminder that there's another way of living in the world. If you're hungry for that, um, join us. And when I say join, I don't mean join the church, join religion, or, or become anything other than a lover of humanity. Um, and maybe a lover of humanity who connects with God in, 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 in some profound way. But I'm going to invite you to pray a very religious prayer. It's called the Lord's Prayer. Um, I, I like to pray it here. It's one of the few times I do like to pray it because it's a prayer written in the plural. It only makes sense uh, when we pray with each other, for each other. Um, so let's pray together. Our Father, 